Hey there! In this video, I will show you how to use a graphical user interface database client such as dBeaver to connect to a database in DDEV running on Windows subsystem for Linux 2, also known as WSL2 with Ubuntu. For this scenario, the setup is as follows. Windows as a main operating system with Ubuntu installed via WSL2 and a project with a working database setup that runs on DDEV within Ubuntu. Now, the problem is how do we connect to the database? We can connect through the command line, but I think it would be easier to use a tool with a graphical interface. So let's find out. Let's spin up the Ubuntu instance with WSL2. For this tutorial, we'll use dBeaver. There are several ways you can install it. You can go to dbeaver.io slash download to check them all, but I'll keep it simple and install the community edition via Snap. All right, now that we have dbeaver installed, let's change the directory to the project where we have the database set up. And in here, run ddev the beaver to launch the beaver. ddev will start your project's Docker containers before opening the beaver in case the containers are not already running. Most likely, the beaver will ask you to install the drivers for your database. This is important to install them because otherwise you will not be able to connect or the database will throw errors. All right, now you can notice that the application is launched through Ubuntu and DDEV has already configured the connection for us. Let's go ahead and inspect the database. Let's open this migrations table. Let's add something just to test out that this is working properly. All right, the entry has been saved and the DB is working as expected. All right, that was it. If you enjoyed this video, consider checking out the other tutorials from this channel. Wishing you a wonderful day, and I look forward to catching you in the next one.